You. You miss me, sweetheart. What? Nothing to say? If you are here, then Washington is safe. True, true. Thing is, I believe I've just been pardoned. Thank you kindly for the rescue, gents. There can be no further mistakes, Thomas. Am I understood? What about this, the assassin? Yeah, he's here. They put him in a cell right next to mine. Guess we didn't get them all, eh? Deal with this, Charles. At once, sir. What are we gonna do? You're that boy from the Continental Congress. Adams's little lapdog. Hmm. I think I have an idea. Yes. Two birds with one stone. Do tell. All in good time. It's not like the assassin's going anywhere. For now, we should see about getting you better accommodations here. What are you on about? I thought I was getting out. I'm afraid you won't be leaving for a while, thanks to Benjamin Talmadge. He's been running his mouth, saying all sorts of things. You're being investigated for plotting to assassinate George Washington. What a bunch of bollocks. I thought you was going to handle that. We'll discuss this elsewhere. Should get in on it. Yeah? And what makes you think that? Caught him carving something in the yard. Slipped it in his pocket real quick when he saw me. Looked like a key. Probably just a shiv. Nah. Mason ain't a fighter. Always talking and tricking his way out of trouble. Weasel Weems, they call him. Stinky bastard. Come on, Finch. He's not so bad. Even told me some letters once. Gonna write a note to my lady. Ha! What for? You think that whore's out there pining for you? Saving herself for when you get out? Huh? No doubt she's already moved on to the next fella, and the fella after him. You shut your mouth for I shut it for you. Easy now. It was just a joke. Yeah? Well, it wasn't very funny. We do hope I think I'll raise hogs next. No way a fox can carry up a 500-pound pig. <laughs> Get up! Where are we going? Stay out of trouble or you'll wind up in the pit. I checked the coffee shop myself. There was not left, but the wind's cast off, so one of third rate leavings. What are you looking at, half-breed? Yes, we did. Well, the skull was well obvious. Would have been a pretty kettle of eels. You not understand English? That it? Do I need to knock some sense into that thick head of yours? The eel is the dragon is tending towards water these days. I should try and find this weems fellow. If he intends to escape, perhaps he can help me. Mason Weems? Could be. I need your help. Oh? They say you know a way out of here. They say a lot of things. I do not have time for games. A shame, as I was hoping you might play one with me. You could ask. Fine. Are you familiar with the rules? <laughs> Seeing as you already know mine, what's your name? Connor. Pleased to meet you, Connor.
Well played. So, what brings you to Bridewell? Treachery. I have been falsely accused. Of course you have. You do not believe me? Why should I? You have the look of a brute. <laughs> you misjudge. I am an honest man. And yet, also a man imprisoned. Tell me how you found yourself in this place. It is a private matter. As is what you ask of me. Yes, I saw that on my way through Park. Terrible. I was trying to prevent a murder. Oh! Anyone I know? George Washington. The others put you up to this, didn't they? Thought it might be fun to have another laugh at Mason's expense. Fools, a lot of them. To make light of something like this? George Washington is brave beyond measure. Loyal like a brother, peerless in character, and unshakable in his convictions. That man is our Jupiter Conservator. Destined to lead us not just to freedom, but greatness. Anyone who says otherwise is either a simpleton or a traitor. Then you understand why I need to get out of here. If I don't help him, he is going to die. You're serious, aren't you? I think it has to do with the beetle. The little one that well, used to. Very well. It's going to take some doing. See, everything hinges on the key I forged. That loud finch stole it. it. Took me three months to make the thing, too. You need to get it back, or we're not going anywhere. Consider it done. We also have a choir supplemented by some of the garrison officers. Bloody! It'd be astounding how sweet and nice we can melt out. It's a long journey. Not sure I'd have the sea legs in me to embark again so soon. American variety caught fire with too much gumption. Really? All right, scoundrels, back in your cells! Indeed. That farm caught, eh? If I caught near my horse, I'd give him. Can't pronounce her. Well, I'm not sure one of them could lead the way out of a brand. This key is useless. What are you looking at? You in the market for us, Bin? You chanced upon a copy of this late. I think I'll raise hogs next. No way a fancy crowd. More like down fuss of itself. Your key is useless. What do you mean? It did not fit the lock. It's not meant to. You forged a key that does not work. Well, that all depends on what you mean by work. It'll get us out of here. Just not the way you expected. Then how? You're going to use it to get the real key off the warden. You have to swap yours for his. Why not just have me take the real key? Why all this extra work? You might notice if it went missing. This way, he'll be none the wiser. And when he tries to use it? He won't. That's why we're targeting him. <sighs> How do I reach the warden? Yes. This next part, you may not like. Oh, as if I've liked the others. Out with it. You need to pick a fight. What? Pick a fight, and they'll throw you in the pit. 
And how in the world does this help us? The Warden oversees the pit. Getting sent there is the only way to reach him. This American variety caught fire I give you credit. You've given this plan to risk my life a great deal of thought. Take down as many as you can. One or two will only serve to entertain the guards. You need to make them angry. We all have our part to play. Try not to die. You're not but swine, suckling at the teats of civilization, thieves and scoundrels all. And do you acknowledge this? Do you repent and beg forgiveness? Need to take care not to raise the alarm. You'll find Hickey through that door. It's where they keep the important prisoners. Nicer rooms, more space, those sorts of things. It seems even in prison, who you know makes all the difference. Thank you, Mason, for everything. I will find a way to repay the favor when my work here is finished. <laughs> 